Sasa, and today I'm going to be showing you how I make this awesome drink. It's, um, I call it lemon honey tea, even though it's not tea, there's no tea in it. It's just water, honey, lemon, and I added some cranberries. Um, adding the cranberries was a recent thing I started doing. I used to drink this, used to, I always drink this whenever I'm sick or whenever you want a hot drink in the winter time because I, my body can't take caffeine very well, so I tend not to drink less tea and I, obviously I don't drink any coffee. So... I like to drink this. My mom would always make uh, lemon and honey water for us as kids when you're sick, but I added the uh, cranberries, so it's really yummy drink. This is really great when you're sick because the lemon is antibacterial and the honey also helps to soothe your throat, so if you have cough or anything, and um, it just heats your body up, which is really good. Okay, start by boiling your water, and it helps to go faster if you put the lid on. Okay, so you're gonna need one slice of lemon, or a thick slice. Sometimes I do two slices. Okay, so personally for me, I really hate drinking my tea or my drink, whatever, when there's these seeds in. So I always take the extra effort to like pick out these bloody seeds. They're just really annoying. And if you can't see the seeds, you just take this piece of lemon, hold it up to the light, and you'll just see all the seeds, and then you just pick them all out. So my piece is ready. Okay, I like to add cranberries to this drink because the tartness of the cranberries with this um, sourness of the lemon and the sweetness of the honey, they really go nice together. And I just love the combo of uh, cranberry and lemon. So um, there's these two different cranberries. So this is like your regular cranberries that you would find, like the whole dried one. And I found this one. Um, it's made with less sugar. They don't use oil and keeping the oil, so the, um, the seller said, it keeps the um, kind of moisture and it sucks it up. So I'll show you the difference here. So this is what it is. And um, so yeah, there's less sugar in this. And so that way, instead of tasting more sugar of sweetness, you actually taste the tartness of the cranberries. And I really Yeah, so here you can see kind of like the regular cranberries that you can find everywhere. And then this is the um, less sugar with no oil. So if you can find these, this would be great. I don't know if this brand is sold outside of Quebec, but um, yeah, I really love these. And I just recently tried these out at a trade show. And so here you can see for the less sugar one, you have 17 grams of sugar per 40 grams. And this one is 28 grams, so there's quite a big difference there. And um, yeah, like I said, this one has no fat. The ingredients for this is um, cranberries and sugar. Uh, for the other one, where is it? It's cranberry, sugar, and sunflower oil. So I add about a small handful. This is the um, the less sugar one. Right up. Next, you take a spoon, and it helps if your spoon is extra long. Well, it depends on the size of your cup. So here's my spoon. And we'll get some honey. Take a spoonful. It's better to get less honey in the beginning, and then you can always add later. Do, 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 do. Okay, honey goes inside. With the lemon, what you want to do is use your spoon and you just want to squash it down so this way you can get the juices to come out. After I add the water, you just stir it a bit so that the honey can melt. Voila! It's all ready. You can wait a bit before drinking it. I only wait a bit because the water is really hot and it's burn yourself. So I just wait a bit and then you can enjoy. So thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope you try this out and I hope you like it. Ready? And come bye.